behold the world's smallest pressing ion yes you might be wondering is this the world's smallest pressing ion yes it is this pressing ion is voltage adaptive in such a way that it works with 110 volts and 220 volts that means in the western world they can use this pressing ion because they use about 110 volts why we in africa here we can still use this pressing ion because it's 220 volts that means it's voltage adaptive wherever you stay you can actually use this pressing ion because the two voltages which which we have in the world are mostly 110 volt and 220 volt and this pressing ion consumes as low as 100 to 200 watt that means if you stay in an environment where your national grid is 110 volt it consumes about 100 watt and if you stay uh, in a place where your national grid is 220 volt or whatever you use is produces an output of 220 volt you can use this pressing ion you might be wondering is this pressing ion actually effective yes it is because this pressing ion uh, also heat up to as high as 180 degrees celsius up to 220 degrees celsius which every other pressing ion that consumes as high as 700 watt to 2200 watt uh, gives yes because most of the pressing ion we have you know have temperature or uh, the heating temperature is about 180 to 220 degrees Celsius. This pressing ion does the same thing. So if you stay in an environment where your national grid or your electricity bill have been increased and you have been using your pressing ion that consumes about 800 watt to 200 uh, to 2200 watt, then you can cut down your electricity bill using this pressing ion. If you're talking about the effectiveness, you need to worry no more because it will stretch out your squeezed, you know, shirt, your squeezed knickers or your squeezed trousers because it's very very effective and if you use this inverter you've been looking forward for how to get a pressing ion that will actually work very very convenient with your inverter then this is the best option for you whether you use one kva and above this uh, pressing ion can work very very well and it's convenient to use with your system because most of the deep freezers we have actually consumes more than you know this pressing ion because most of these deep freezers actually consume 210 watt or even 220 watt why this pressing ion consumes as low as 200 watt so if you use this inverter this is the best option for you don't forget to save you time it will cut down your electricity bill and it will not give your inverter headache